For the last three days, these have been the scenes in Mutonyi village, the area is found in Matete sub-county in Kakamega county. In total, 25 houses have been touched since Sunday in skirmishes pitting all inhabitants and new buyers who settled in the region recently. Kurudi, masatisa, nilikutana na mutu njiani. Ananiambia usiende nyumbani, wameasha moto kwa nyumba yako. The incident is reported to have been retaliatory attacks following the death of one person three weeks ago. This was after the deceased allegedly refused to be compensated for the land he had bought from the original owner years ago. Walikuwa nasa sana kwa maneno ya shamba na mununusi. Na mununusi vile alikufa hii kapisa makano hii papangu ndia ame leta hii shida. Na wachama kutoka matetu wakakucha kasema ukwa enye mepaki na kutuchome nyumba sao sote. Tens of families have been displaced and are now seeking shelter elsewhere. Nilikuja, nikapata nyumba angi imechomwa. Mali angu yoti ilikuwa ndani, imechomelewa. Maindi, makuni arubaine, maragwe, na vitu nyingi hata senye zuwezi ya sabo. Kwa sasa kama mimi, mwenyewe, ni maamia kwa uka wangu, Mount Elikon, kia kwenye naishi. Police are holding in custody five suspects over the flare-up. Ninini inasababisha kuchoma manyumba? Ama kuna kitu ingine munafanya kando ya kuchoma manyumba? Mutonyi Primary School has been highly affected with many pupils remaining at home. Head teacher anajua ya kwamba amekuwa na watoto full class. Sai watoto awafiki nusu ni kwa nini? Local leaders have held several meetings in a bid to resolve the differences. So all eyes are now on the state security agencies to see if they'll be able to control the situation here that has been caused by a land conflict between the inheritors of this land and new buyers. We'll see News in Matete sub-county in Kakamega.